Hey guys, Samantha here. So I wanted to talk to you all a little bit about Black Leopard, Red Wolf, Marlon James. Uh, the copy that I have is one of the galleys, so the final release version may be a little different, but um, from whatever, it's pretty much the same. So this book is 622 pages, and this is not the mass market paperback, it is the full-size paperback. So that being said, it was definitely an undertaking to read this book. Um, took me a few months to get through it. Usually I'm a pretty fast reader. It was something that I was not expecting when I picked it up. Um, it is high fantasy. It is very intense. There is a lot of language that I would describe as convoluted. Um, it was an undertaking. The Jamaican slang in it is something that I don't normally read, so it took me a while to get in the swing of that and understand really what was going on. The first 100, 150 pages were um, hard for me. That probably took me three or four months to get through the first 100 pages. But after that, it was pretty smooth sailing. So the story really goes, um, centers around a tracker who is trying to find a child. There are some fantastical characters, witches, leopards that turn into people, so on and so forth. Um, I won't ruin that for you. But the story is told present day and looking back. Um, it seems to me like the tracker really is a storyteller. So some of it is true, some of it is not. They tell the same version or different versions of the same events multiple times and it kind of leaves it up to you as what's going on. So I would recommend reading this book, especially if you are a literary person or if you really love high fantasy. Um, one note I will make is if you get through the first hundred or so pages, it does get a lot easier to read after you get into the swing. So um, yeah, that's just my quick review on Black Leopard Red Wolf. I do think it's worth mentioning the language because I think that can turn people off when they start reading. Um, if you're not expecting that, it is a wild ride. I'm really looking forward to reading his other book, um, The Seven Killings one, but I haven't gotten to it yet. So if you guys have read Black Leopard Red Wolf, if you loved it, if you hated it, if you had any thoughts on it, please share those below in the comments. Um, I'd love to hear what you guys have to say. Thanks for hanging out.